Jenny's softball on its home field at South Rec March 11th and 12th to host MIAA games in Warrensburg for the first time this season. UCM's conference record coming into the weekend is 3-1. and one. Starting with a Friday doubleheader against Missouri Western, it's a scoreless game one until the fourth inning. Though the Griffins did have bases loaded in the top of the first, Mo West is the first on the scoreboard in the fourth with a double that brings in two base runners. Griffs plate another in the sixth, then blow the lead wide open in the seventh with five runs on just two hits. Jins leave eight on base in this game, and Missouri Western wins game one, eight nothing. Game two is a pretty solid defensive effort for both teams. No scoring this one until the fifth inning, and the first run is for Western, courtesy of Paige Shiflet. Shiflet then hits a home run in the top of the seventh. Griffins sweep the Jins with a two nothing win in game two. Saturday brought the second straight doubleheader, this one against Northwest. Game one starts with the Bearcats scoring in the top of the first, but the Jennings wait to answer until the bottom of the second when Haley Crabtree hits a double that scores Alex Linhart. Top of the third, big inning for Northwest, and the Bearcats play three more runs, taking a 4-1 to one lead. Jin score again in the third on an Emily King home run, so it's 4-2. to two. The fourth inning brings four runs in for UCM, and the Jins take over the lead 6-4. to four. No more scoring in this one, so the Jins win game one, 6 to four. Game two has the Jennies looking for a sweep. Lauren Mabe gets the scoring started in the bottom of the first, bringing Allie Jo Rogers home. In the second, a single to left field brings in two for Northwest, and the Bearcats lead 2-1. to one. A homer in the third makes it 3-1 to one Northwest. Then two runs off two hits puts the visitors up 5-1 to one in the fifth inning. But we see a big answer from the Jennies in the bottom of that inning. Five runs on four hits with one runner left on base. UCM takes over the lead 6-5. to five. A bases loaded walk in the top of the seventh helps Northwest tie up the game 6-6, six six, but in the bottom of the seventh last chance for the Jins, Rogers is walked. Steals second, advances to third on a wild pitch, then scores on another wild pitch for the walk-off win. UCM takes game two and the sweep 7-6. Jenny softball is now 13 and 12 overall, 5 and 3 in the MIAA, and UCM is taking a little break from conference play this weekend, instead playing a handful of in-region games in St. Joe at the Apple Market Softball Classic. Reporting for UCMAthletics.com, I'm Katie Smith.